stopping by while I have a sweet tooth and it is acting up and when that happens I like to make one of my favorite cookies a chocolate chocolate chip peanut butter with walnut cookie and if you want to see how I make it then just keep watching start sifting my dry ingredients. I have a bowl and a strainer and I'm going to go ahead and add a cup of flour in my strainer. Now I'm adding a third of a cup of cocoa powder, a half a teaspoon of baking soda, and to round it off just an eighth of a teaspoon of salt. And now you just want to grab your strainer and then begin sifting all of your dry ingredients so you don't have any lumps. Okay, so I'm done with my dry ingredients. I'm going to go ahead and sift that to the side and get started with my wet ingredients. So what I did is I left a stick of unsalted butter out overnight so that it would be easier to mix. So I'm going to go ahead and add one stick of butter to my bowl. Now I'm adding three-fourths of a cup of peanut butter to the mix. I'm adding three-fourths cup of sugar as well. So right now I'm going to add in a half a cup of packed brown sugar. You can use either light or dark, but today I'm going to use dark. So now you want to take your hand mixer and just mix everything until it's nice and smooth. so it would be easier to mix. Then you want to take your mixer again and just make sure that the vanilla and the egg is well combined. So now I'm ready to combine my dry ingredients with my wet ingredients and I'm going to do it in three parts until everything is mixed together and this is what's going to create the perfect cookie dough. chips and my nuts just to make sure that it stays whole. So I have my cookie sheet lined up with parchment paper. I have my ice cream scooper so that my cookies are around the same size and I'm just going to scoop them out until I'm all done. soft and chewy. So you guys, my cookies are all done. They look so good. They look perfect. So I'm going to let them cool just for a little bit and then I'm going to give one a try. You guys, I think this is probably one of my favorite cookie recipes I've ever made. Between the chocolate and the peanut butter and the walnuts, it makes the perfect cookie and it will definitely satisfy your sweet tooth. So you guys, you absolutely have to give this recipe a try. I guarantee you will love it. So comment down below, let me know what you think. And also, if there's any suggestions of what you may want me to make, I'm open to any suggestions. So let me know in the comment section. And if you like this video, hit me with a like button and don't forget to subscribe. I really appreciate it. But thank you so much for watching. Take care and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.